Welcome to our step-by-step -step tutorial on how to log in to your Edisalot router. Whether you're setting up your router for the first time or need to adjust your network settings, this video will guide you through the process. Let's get started. Before we begin, let's gather the information you'll need. Most Edisalot routers use the default IP address 192.168.1.1 or 192. 1680-1. You'll also need the default username and password, which are usually printed on a sticker on the back or bottom of your router. First, ensure your device is connected to your Edisalot router's Wi-Fi network. Use default Wi-Fi name and password to connect first time. You can connect via Wi-Fi or an Ethernet cable for a more stable connection. Connect LAN cable to Rotor Ethernet port and plug into laptop or desktop LAN port for wired connection. Next, open your preferred web browser such as Chrome, Firefox, or Safari. In the address bar, type the default IP address of your router, either 192.168.1.1 or 192 .1 and press Enter. You'll now see the Edisalot router login page. Enter the default username and password. To configure the WAN settings, navigate to the settings and then go to WAN section in the admin dashboard. This is where you'll set up your internet connection. Select the type of connection provided by your ISP. This is usually PPPoE for Edisalot. Username and password. Enter the PPPoE username and password provided by Edisalot. After configure WAN settings, don't forget to click save or apply to ensure your settings are updated. You will see status connected. To change your Wi-Fi settings, navigate to the wireless or Wi-Fi section in the top menu. For dual band Wi-Fi router, change SSID Wi-Fi name and Wi-Fi password for 2.4 GHz and 5.8 GHz band. Network name, SSID enter a new name for your Wi-Fi network. Make sure it's unique and easy to recognize. Channel, if you're experiencing interference, try changing the Wi-Fi channel to a less congested one. Password. Create a strong password using a mix of uppercase and lowercase letters, numbers, and special characters. Security mode. Ensure your network is using WPA2 or WPA3 encryption for the best security. After save settings navigate page and change 5 GHz Wi-Fi name and password. Change Wi-Fi channel, update Wi-Fi password. After making any changes, don't forget to click save or apply to ensure your settings are updated. Your router may restart and your devices will need to reconnect using the new settings. To enable a guest Wi-Fi network, navigate to the guest network. Enable multi SSID. Create Wi-Fi name for guest network and create a Wi-Fi password. After making any changes, don't forget to click save or apply. Now restart router and your devices will need to reconnect using the new Wi-Fi name and password. Reconnect your mobile or a laptop with new Wi-Fi name and password and test your internet speed to confirm your internet plan. You've successfully set up your, your Etisalot router to secure your home internet. If you found this guide helpful, like, share and subscribe channel to get more tech guide. Thanks for watching.